why you may need an auto clicker now maybe you need an auto clicker for some extra cash or some extra levels and the only way you've been doing it recently is just constantly talking to the npcs over and over saying yes yes yeah to all the fight them again and again but i have a solution for you for you to have an auto clicker and do this automatically without you press any buttons or any of that and that's what this video is going to be about how to set up an auto clicker so you don't have to press buttons or do it manually so you have it automatically all set up for you and it'll be much easier for you to grind your levels and your money before the video continues i want to mention this is for computers 20 likes on this video and you guys will see a video on mobile auto clicking also want to mention if you're new like subscribe turn on notifications and hopefully you guys enjoyed the video let's get it started on how to set it up get the ones you want to level up once you have them in your team you are good make sure your highest level to know is on the first one the first team so it's much easier you will go to battle set this one the first move to the highest one you want so lunar rain or headbutt whatever move that you think does a lot of damage for your tenorians if your opponent has a tenorian that is weaker against your tenorian then put them in the front or if they're higher level put those tenorians in the front What you just saw was an automatic clicking where I didn't even have to do anything like typing or anything. Everything was just set up for me and I was just doing it for me. Guy right here with his capybara as an example. So it's much easier for all of us to understand. And that way you guys also know that you could do this in any place. It doesn't matter what NPC, as long as you know what to do and you set it up. Preferably the easiest way is if it's one Tenorian and you're able to one shot it. It's the best way and that's the quickest way so you could get more money and more XP. Doesn't matter which area you are or which area do you want to do it. You could do it in any area you want, does not matter. As long as you could one shot them and it makes it much easier and quicker. Now, if you have not heard before, this is Tiny Task. What does Tiny Task do? Well, there's this recording thing, so it records whatever, you know, clicking, movement all that stuff it all does it for you but what we're going to be using is just the clicking part not the keyboard part now i already have my setup but i'm going to redo it just for the sake of this video now i'm just going to take everything off so it's much easier for you guys to see this is something where you should be seeing i will probably put in the description or in the pinned comment tiny task where you could download it if you don't have it yet and then you could just follow along now it's easier if you go to recording hotkey go to f8 so now when you press f8 on your keyboard it sets it up now that's the recording hotkey and playback hotkey is going to be important later what we're going to do first is get really close to our character once we've done that we're going to get close to the npc by their shoulder or arm and then you press F8 to record. Once you pressed it, you click on every area right here. Just follow along. Every single area right there. Keep clicking and then this area right here. And then after that, you could go and press yes. Just give it a few seconds and then press yes. Once that's done, you wait. Wait for the cutscene. Wait for all that dialogue. Okay. Now we're gonna wait a little bit more. Just a few seconds. One, two, three, four. We waited four seconds. Now we go to attack. We wait a little bit. Then you press your first move. And then just in case anything goes wrong, you 
hit this area right here where my mouse is, just keep clicking there, and it makes it much easier. So in case if anything happens, it's there. I stopped clicking. You should too, if you haven't yet. Stop clicking after that. Then, that's done. What you're going to do is press F8, and that's done. Once that's done, you press F8, you go back to Tiny Task. Go to Preference. You go to Recording Hotkey, set it up to Control shift alt R. Doesn't really matter because you're not really going to press it. Now you go to Playback Hotkey. This is the part where I said it was going to be important later. You press F8. Once you press F8, you're good. But we're not done yet. We have to put Continuous Playback. Now we have it like this. Now, you could close that. Not really close it, but put it this little minus. So now it goes back. Then you press F8. And then there. The auto clicker is on. I'm not clicking. Everything is doing it for me. And that's how you set up the auto clicker. Hopefully that was easy for you guys to understand. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments. I will try my best to reply. Um, if you have detailed questions uh, and you do not understand some type of step, join our Discord server and just send it there and I will try to reply to it and give you back a uh, detailed answer as much as I can, as much is capable of me to do. Now, also, if the video did help you out, it would really be appreciated if you did like, subscribe, turn on notifications, share the video, and follow all our social medias. They're in the description. Join our Discord, Twitter, follow us, Instagram, TikTok, all that stuff. Join us, follow us, etc. Join our Roblox group. We have Roblox outfits. The one my, char my Roblox character is wearing right now, you go um, purchase that in our Roblox group. It helps us out to make future videos on guides or just other games. Anyways, hopefully that was helpful. That's pretty much the end of the video. And the next video will probably be which NPC you should go against so you get the most XP and the most money. And that'll probably be either this time, by the time I'm recording this video, or on the next update. So you should be subscribed with notifications so you are up to date for that. Anyways, that's the end of the video. Again, hopefully that it did help you out in your future grinding for the game money and levels so see you guys next time stay safe and take care